So 50% of the people of the world live in cities today. Based on the trends that are occurring, that model will continue to accelerate. The city infrastructure has to be able to support the influx of people. We need a better understanding of how all of the different systems within our cities operate and interoperate. There's a system that manages typically public health capabilities. There's another group that's focused on transportation systems. There's another group that's focused on public safety and dispatching of police and fire vehicles. There's people that are focused on education. So what we've been doing is we've been working with a core set of cities and we're spending our time helping them understand what the platform would look like so they don't need to build individual silos anymore. Our approach is to enable those systems with a common platform, with a common set of tools and services, and then a common set of vertical applications in the middle that will support them. If you look at what OSIsoft does, you can start to see things like, what are the chances that my public works vehicles will be operating in the capacity that they need? As well as, do I have the right people and the right work schedules to make this happen? As you've got Pi servers that are implemented and data is being aggregated, and as you look at the new uh, Cloud Connect capabilities, all of the different services that you're seeing will become a plug and play. They'll become snappable within this environment. The end result from a front end perspective for the city leaders or the government leaders who don't typically look at Excel, they look at this instead. So this is a dashboard, green is good, uh, orange or yellow, something I need to address. Red means trending down significantly quickly. These are all being based upon public data. These are open government and open data data sets. The reason I say this to you is there is this evolution that is occurring from the data infrastructure, from all of the cloud capabilities, to the line of business applications, to the end result being what you're seeing right now. The benefits and the complexities come from ensuring that those vertical lines or those vertical systems all appear.